Hey guys, Spartan here, welcome back to Future Armor the Game. I'm gonna do level 3 this time, and maybe level 4. I think level 3 is not as long as level 2. But yeah, I haven't died yet somehow, which is actually surprising, because you expect to die a lot in this game, and this game is really stingy with lives. Like, usually in these games, considering it's me, I like to end on 99 lives. I don't even think that's possible in this game, with how many uh, live drops there are. Yeah, these guys are really annoying. They have shotguns, they uh, attack at range, they have uh, liquid cheese, as stated here. And yeah, they kind of suck. Also, they have this weird revenge bullet system, where sometimes when they die, they will uh, shoot out one last wow. shot at you. I had my first kiss in subway car. These Just melee like guys have, like, double health, but Homeless not as dangerous. Man. I'm not rich, but I'm comfortable. <laughs> they have this you know weird, like? Money. squeaky uh, movement noise. Hey, a nibbler! I'm gonna collect all. Of them. Like they have squeaky shoes, and that is really uh, I, I guess it's iconic because there's actually no music on this stage. Oddly enough, I don't get why, but there just is none. Okay. If he was doing the revenge shot, which you'll notice they do when they fall over backwards, I would have, like, ran out of this car. I think a new guy spawns. Yep. There's no way to stop that once it's happened, you just need to get out of the way. And they deal pretty significant damage, I mean, that's how much damage it did to me, and that was not a direct hit. Right here we get the shotgun. Uh, it is... A very good weapon. Like, it, it's a better weapon, but the pistol has more uh, versatility. Also, this only has 200 max ammo. So, uh, we're going towards Manhattan, I guess. Also, the way this game does uh, enemy spawning, you'll see there's no enemy in this cart. Let me flick the camera inside to show you this specifically. Yep. As soon as I step inside, though, there he is. Ah, camera, please. This game's Go camera fly. is Go not good Go in fly. tighter spaces. Also, yeah, this thing takes uh, five bullets per shot. But considering that ammo drops are like 50s, you don't need a uh, full charge half the time to like kill enemies with this gun. It is kind of useful as you can get like collateral kills sometimes, but yeah, it runs out of ammo fast. Point of the realm. Point of the realm. Yeah. So anyone who can read uh, alien text, translate that. That's a trick. I already know what it says. It says Elvis was here because I looked that up at some point. But yeah, here's an instance of game rendering out a part of the level. Do you notice the seam on the ground? Uh, that's because this is a loading point of uh, what needs to be loaded out. It's kind of genius how they do it, because like, you jump down here, you lag the game I guess, and uh, yeah, you can't go back. You actually can get back with a very precise jump, but like this rubble here blocks off the doorway so you can't see that the entire area beyond there is like, unloaded, unless you do what I'm doing, and very specifically angling the camera, where it's giving you like a glitchy effect, because there's there's nothing there, there's like no texture. So it's like dragging the last texture that has crossed the plane. Really interesting stuff if you're uh, somebody who has the name of the real Spartan. But yeah, I only need like 10 ammo charge shots to kill them, this and it's a lot faster than using the pistol. If I need to, I will, uh, switch. Also, you can do a very brief charge, which only costs 5 ammo. Which is good enough at early range. Filthy Luca. But yeah, those guys have, like, effectively 10 pistol shots of health. To think the Professor could have probably got a... Ow. That hurt. Professor probably could have got a better gun than this, like, the shitty pistol with his, uh, 
dark matter engine holding. I guess he's just not very good at negotiation. He is seen Another out. nibbler. Yeah, these things better be worth some. Spoilers fry, they uh, are not worth anything. The future is here. Evidently not, the future is now. Free ammo. <laughs> <laughs> There's the iClub New York. That's an iconic thing, isn't it? You need to be very good at dodging. There's another shotgun there, in case you missed uh, the one that I picked up. But yeah, uh, it also restores you to 200 ammo if you need it. Also, full lives, I mean extra lives, do not heal you. <laughs> I know some games they do, not this game. Yeah, let's get some uh, extra cash. There's collectible changes throughout the uh, characters you play as. Very janky way to pick that up, but it works. Damn. It almost feels like I'm on the, the Bean Lee line. That's an Australian joke. Actually, that's not even an Australian joke, that's a Brisbane joke. Or Queensland joke, I guess, technically. No, oh, why'd I charge up there? Time to get ganked. Wow, that was failure. I think there's a bug in this game where the uh, level 3 charge has the uh, level 1 charge power or something like that and it's reversed. I wouldn't know though, I'm making assumptions. You can pick those up through the wall really? Huh. Kind of odd. Ah, please. Also yeah, there's the third shotgun. If you don't grab it there, you're never gonna get it. The six pack of slurm, that's a hundred percent health. I've always liked this little scene here. This guy menacingly uh, just shows up and he's just a normal enemy. <laughs> normal enemy without a gun. Gotta react quickly. Also, yeah, this smoke hurts you. Rapidly. It is instant death if you are not careful. Yeah. Ideally, you'd like to use the pistol to spray these. But yeah. I'll put this toward my college education. So you may have noticed that Fry never gave his "I found all the nibblers" thing in stage one. That's because there was only one nibbler. Only says it if there's at least two. No time to take a shit here. Was there only 75 in this stage? There had to be. Because there is... the level's basically over at this point. And there's no way that there's 25 uh, cash pickups in this last, like, 3 seconds. Is there an ammo pickup that I left? No, I guess not. Uh, that was Subway. The level with no music, because it was, like, trying to be eerie or something. And here you will see the game start to chug, because this stage chugs like hell. And yeah, that was like only 8 minutes. I don't need to save here. I'm just going to do this one and the uh, same thing. Join the army. What are you, chicken? I do like these loading screens that have uh, character stuff. Also, by me complimenting the loading screens, I don't have to cut them out. But they're short enough anyway. This, get this stage has like the best music, I'm pretty sure. If you can ignore the chugging. Ah, old New York. Over there's where I first got mugged. Homeless people. <laughs> yeah, homeless people. Fry being slowed down by 10%. Gotta hide behind that so the rocket launcher guy doesn't get me. Go fry! Go fry! Go fry! And yeah, these. These like green alien dudes are just reskinned other dudes. You got me a fine piece of money. Also, there's a uh, cash in the trash. So we can confirm this is a uh, Billy Mays commercial. Yeah, nice, nice ambient music here. The rocket launcher guys are very dangerous though. Very easy to dodge, but if you do not, 
They, they, they hurt you. In fact, it's probably... The fry, please. Probably the best moment to use the uh, pistol here. Just because it's very accurate. Okay, I guess I'm out of range. Yeah, he just wasn't loaded in properly, I guess. Like, he's all, you can see it's using a low quality model. Yeah. I guess I'm literally just too far away. I'll try and get a little closer. Oh, need to enter first person before doing that. This guy only has five health, so... A fully charged pistol shot would kill him. I just don't think this guy is loaded in yet. That's kind of odd. I'm really close to him at this point. Fuck it, I'm just gonna bum rush him. Yeah, I guess he hadn't entered his script to move forwards. Yeah, I'll use the pistol for a bit. By the way, ammo pickups, they give ammo to all your guns when you uh, pick them up. Also, yeah, this is the animation of Fry walking backwards. I do not want to be this close to a rocket launcher guy. <laughs> yeah, that's why I don't usually use the pistol for combat. Let's switch back to the shotgun. Fortunately, charge shots are stagger enemies. Scrap bar. Unfortunately, the lag of this game makes the music sound very weird. <laughs> like it's slowing down and then speeding back up. I would recommend listening to the actual OST version for this song. Like, when it's not jumping around like it currently is, it sounds a lot better. Yeah, I'll switch back to the pistol. So if you get 50 ammo, for instance, it gives 50 to every gun. Hey, that beam looks like it's about to give way. Well, let's shoot it then. I think that's the same uh, sound effect that played when all the trash was uh, falling down. Ah, uh, here's this iconic childhood puzzle. There's a nibbler behind there, but you can't get through it with anything. So you press this. And then these things. So it's like... Oh, press the wrong one. There you go. Right, you were meant to say something there. Okay, that's just an audio glitch. You can shoot these glass models, it doesn't do anything. Tipping is not a city in China. Okay. New York and Brooklyn. This Brooklyn's in New York, I don't know, I'm not American. What do you expect me to know American geography? There's a stove. Would you like a stove? Stove is important. I really don't like jumps in video games that are like, you don't need the maximum length with your like grab maneuver. Like, if it was just a little lower, you could reach it normally, but it could be like a lot higher. Okay, Fry's voice is just not playing anymore for some reason. Honestly, I'm kind of okay with that because it gets annoying after he's just saying like, Stupid shit like a. Stove bomb. So there's like a trick you can do here. Where if you get down properly, you can uh, ignore all the enemy spawns in this region. I think I did that once. But yeah, you see that enemy did like over a quarter of my health with one shotgun blast. Oh, we're going to the reggae remix. Stop that, please. All right. Go fry. Go fry. I forgot if my uh, recording picks up the top of the window. I don't think it does, so therefore you cannot see the speed. 
This dude is right below me, isn't he? And stay down. Idiot. Never fight with a guy who has the high ground. Lock on for this game is uh, amazing. It's a lifesaver. Hear people yelling outside. What do they have to yell about? I don't get why, but the internet kind of works outside. But my computer isn't outside, it's here. I'm not rich, but I'm comfortable. Need to remember to open the trash cans to get the cash. I said I wasn't going to worry about getting all the cash, but he... why? Why me? The foolishness. I mean, when it's like that close, doesn't matter. But okay, I need to climb up here. Another nibbler. These things better be worth some. Where is he? Oh yeah, you can cancel a thing like that. Right, I want to get up here before this part happens. We've got a very weird enemy here, these dynamite pigs. Annoying, but not exactly deadly if you, uh... Have the high ground. Gotcha. But yeah, these guys, despite the fact that they wield RPGs, can rapid fire. They can like double tap the fucking rocket launcher somehow. I think I've already paid the fee so I can get past this dude. Just made that up on the spot as a stupid joke. What a weird skeleton he has. Hmm. Oh, hadn't touched the checkpoint yet. Big charges for the uh, stupid pigs. Pass that guy before he does his revenge shot. Lock on didn't work properly. I'll put this toward my college education. What do you mean? Certified college dropout. Ah, I did like no damage. I guess I just got hit in the splash. This game surprisingly does not have like static hitboxes, it has like radius ones that like first person shooters these days use. It shows how advanced this game kind of was for its time. Despite the fact that it looks like everyone's made of plasticine. Okay, I tried to charge but I released it too soon. I shot dude. You know what I like? Money. You die now! Okay, gotta get by before he does that. Oh god, the chugging. Hey, at least it, it won't desync my commentary because it's game side. Yeah, you saw that? He just double tapped. He blew up the stuff that he was uh, hiding behind, but yeah. Oil of you holy. What does it say? Something slip system. It's not high enough quality for me to uh, read. That's a war, eh? <laughs> that was a terrible joke. Elevator, use the <laughs> stairs here. Yeah, nice fucking stairs. Ah! Game. That was like the entirety of the game, that was not the emulator issue there. Like, the emulator says how much, uh, speed I'm running on. Currently running at, uh, well actually just dipped to like 87% there. But usually it's running at 100 to 103%. It's gone to 93. Ostrich leeches, $1 is 69. Uh, oh damn, I really do want to yawn now. Back with this, open the, the shed. It's kind of wasteful to use the shotgun to open boxes. Yeah. 
Why'd you do that twice, Fry? Three, okay, you just double tapped the rocket launcher at me. Fortunately, there was a car in the way. Had someone shoot another rocket launcher shot at me. Right! I don't appreciate that. Yeah, I need to switch to the pistol here. Come and get some. Yeah, fighting rocket launcher dudes at range is an easy victory. I think there were explosive pigs that were supposed to spawn at some point here. Yeah. Right, let's go back here. I know that if you don't open this, then they come out of here as well. Power of the uh, charge shot knockback is great. It doesn't say you can open this, but you can. Uh, I forget the button that you used to open it, though. Or well, maybe you had to shoot it. Oh yeah, you had to shoot it. Kind of odd. Yeah, this is uh. He's painfully cute. I guess Leela's parents' room. That stuff Bender's always stealing from. It says Taranga Leela here. I wouldn't know. This is old New York. They shouldn't be here. They should be in the sewers. Ah! Wow. Somehow staggered him. What a shocker. I guess he was coming home to his, uh, Taronga Leela house. Hang on, I need to take a drink. Ugh, I've been talking non-stop for like an hour. Ugh. Keep my throat. <laughs> you know what, I won't even bother trying to finish that sentence. I think I spawned the, uh, mutant explodey pigs. Under the close one, Fry, you numbskull. Oh god, they have pathfinding. They do eventually explode on their own, but it's easier to shoot them. And plus, it's just pistol ammo. Oh, yeah, there they go. Exploded into uh, pork chops. I wasn't a direct hit, so thankfully it did, like, no damage. Ah, okay. Died in one hit. Those things have more than one HP. Yeah, you can see, like, there's holes in the wall where they come from. What does that say? Cafe... Ca... Uh... Yeah, the textures are too low. Like, if there was references, they'd be more obvious. Get me another super intelligent fuzzball. Maybe they're corn cob rolls and broken down keyboards here. What is this room? What was the purpose of it? I think enemies spawn when you step in here. I wouldn't know. Did I miss any of those trash bins? What a find! That contain cash. Yeah, good old, uh... Classic cash register sound. And of course there's cash in the cash register, it makes sense. Yeah, coin of the realm. Yeah, this is a much bigger stage. Like last last stage like 75 cash drops. This one has over well at least 125. I think it's closer to hundred. Maybe even closer to 175. Laser ammo! Kapawi! Yeah, this is the the clothing store, obviously. Lottery tickets, here I come! Just imagine you had this much cash and you spend it all on fucking lottery tickets. Why'd I press the skip button? I don't know where he was going. <laughs> yeah, this is ladies and gentlemen's lingerie. Intimate apparel and there's nothing here. This is obviously a reference to the fact that wearing nothing is more attractive than wearing sexy clothes. That's a lie. Complete lie, and I know it, and you know it. Maybe you don't know it, but trust me. Not so tough now, are you? Fuck on the other one, you fuck. Finally, I'm as rich as the Pope. I'm down to 65 ammo now. Use the 
pistol to break these. You can use the hammer as well, but the hammer is... It, it's kind of a pain to use. <laughs> That's right, bro. Do not destroy circuit box. I mean, you can press it. But if you press it, then the fans eventually come back on. And there's uh, no reason to do that. That's good work. So by saying that, he says that this happened after the uh, the slurm factory uh, episode. I do like how he acknowledges the law of the show. I'm waiting for the next wave of dynamite pigs to show up. It's like the hellhounds in Call of Duty Zombies. They fetch me their souls, and then they fucking blow you up. I, I just smell them. I don't want to risk, like, using just a normal shot and failing to kill them, because they do do a lot of damage if they hit you. Really? Just one? Piece of cake. Yeah, piece of cake. Ah. Okay. I think the uh, rocket launcher guys have a revenge shot as well. I could be wrong, though. But yeah, as you can tell by the nibbler. Count. Ah, uh, we're almost at the end of the stage. There's just one piece of cash left. Johnny Cash. Ah, oh, there you are. I was wondering where he was. No more? Okay. There's gotta be like one last piece of cash somewhere. Tell me I didn't miss it. I'm gonna be kicking myself if I missed exactly one. Saw you there. Oh, there it is. Good. Also, you don't need to kill the uh, absolute last enemy here. That rocket launcher guy that jumps down from there. You can just run here. Right, and that is Old New York. It's only like 27 minutes of the video. Yeah, odd. Oh, well, it's all pretty worth keeping. Regardless, that'll be the end of this episode. Hope you enjoyed, blah blah blah, I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.